Hello, New York. This is Lisa Loeb. I feel like I'm at home in New York City. The audiences seem to be sincere and very loving, but at the same time, very discerning. They won't just fall for anything. And I usually know where to run for a snack or coffee during a break in the day's schedule. And I always see tons of friends from different eras of my life and family too. I think since the success of Stay, I've really continued in the same vein, focusing on lyrics and on the melodies and on the music. With kids' music, though, I've, I've definitely had more fun with humor than I normally am with my more serious, heartfelt songs, which I still write. And musically, I've gone through a lot of different phases, some where I really always wanted to play with my band, and other times when I really like playing alone on stage and everything in between. When I play alone, I'm able to change up the set at the last minute. I can make changes to the songs. Um, the other night, I even made up a song with the audience, which I normally wouldn't do with a band on stage. I guess since I've been continuing along the same road, I guess you could just say I've honed my style. Well, music is still my main medium, and I'm glad that the live concert also includes talking and storytelling, which is my other favorite thing. Um, I also like coloring with crayons and markers. That's very mesmerizing. (laughs) Um, I've also enjoyed selecting and working with visual artists for my album covers, from my first album, Tales, all the way through to my most recent record, No Fairy Tale, and my children's books. And also now I have a new app. We worked with a great illustrator for The Disappointing Pancake with Miblio. Um, It's really an absorbing and a really fun creative process. What can the Tribeca Performing Arts Center audiences expect at my concert? I'm going to play old songs, I'm going to play new songs, mostly my songs, some kids' songs, and probably a lot of explanations of when and why the songs were written, and requests. It's going to be memory lane and new memories. It, it really all depends on who's there and what the night feels like. Anything else I'd like to share or add? That is a huge question. I'm sure I could come up with lots of things. Um, It's funny, you know, when I play in New York City, I feel kind of like I'm the original location of a restaurant that has become a chain, um, like a great chain. But it's just the original place where I really set down roots as a musician, and it fills me with memories, so I love playing in New York City. Also, you know, you can request songs in advance if you tweet me at Lisa Loeb, or write me a message through my Facebook page, my Lisa Loeb official Facebook page. I'll be at the show afterwards signing CDs and kids' books and T-shirts, so definitely come by and say hello.